UVM taking to the Patrick Gym floor to start conference play. Stony Brook, the Seawolves looking to spoil the fun right away in the opener. First half action, Catamount storming out of the gate. Steph Smith cans a mid-range jumper, picking up where he was against Dartmouth last time out. Minutes later, he's back for more, this time from longer range. Catamounts jump out to an eight-point lead, 15-7. Seawolves weather the early storm. Mikhail Foreman with sensational play in the first half drains this three to give Stony Brook a two-point lead, 21-19. But UVM would end the half on a high note. Anthony Lamb heaves it up from long range, connects at the buzzer. The star senior sends UVM into the break up 43-38. Second half, Lamb goes from hitting a buzzer beater to getting dunked on. Mo Gui soars for the highlight reel slam to get Stony Brook within two. Catamounts also have some highlight reel plays up their sleeve. Everett Duncan swishes the three. He's fouled on the play. Breaks up a 47 all tie. Under five to go. Catamounts with a two point lead. Lamb flings it out to Smith in the corner. Dribble, drive, lays it in at the rim, and UVM leads 70 to 66. But the Seawolves come back again to tie it. In the final minute, Elijah Alani finishes in the paint. Stony Brook takes a two-point lead, now up 78-76. Last chance for the Catamounts. They draw it up to go to Mr. Lamb, who tries to make things happen. Shot too strong off the glass. Benny Shungu Gare to get a look. It's a little short, and that's all she wrote. Stony Brook ices it with free throws late, and the Catamounts fall at home to open conference play. We got out toughed on our home court, and it's unacceptable. Um, we knew Stony Brook coming in was very aggressive team, crashing boards, uh, winning 50-50 balls, and you know at the end of the day that just wore us down. If we don't take what lessons and what things we did wrong and and try to get better in the next game that we play, then what was the point of taking this loss and taking that hurt from losing? So that I hope it would bring us together and elevate our game so in the future we don't have to feel the same way. And it doesn't get any easier. UVM will travel to UMBC Saturday for an America's Championship rematch with the Retrievers.